Hey, uh, coming up tomorrow on the show, I just spent the morning with her. Our buddy Stephanie Hansen, our foodie queen, is going to be on the show. And uh, we're really proud of her. We're, I'm so proud of her, and I'm so excited. You're going to get a first look at She wrote a book. Uh, she wrote a cookbook, and I'm so, and she got a hold of it yesterday. And I'm so proud of her. Wait till you see this cookbook, um, and we're going to talk about it uh, tomorrow on the show. Well, today, though, it's week two on The Bachelorette. Really? That happened while I was gone. It, that dumb show came back? Okay. Uh, and with two bachelorettes and more than two dozen guys, it's hard for anyone to stand out. So the ladies invited the men to do a talent show. Look. I think we're ready for the talent. Oh. Today I'm just looking for maybe a little bit of creativity. How much fun can you have with the talent? I'm not just thinking about all the ways that I can connect with you, about all the things that I can show you. The things that I look for are definitely confidence, effort, and how willing you are to kind of commit today. I think they want to see our personalities. And Meatball always comes up with something interesting. You gotta be patient, you'll see. What are meatballs? Oh. I'm scared. No. Oh. 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 Can I go back on the cruise? <laughs> that guy's name is Meatball. <laughs> but it wasn't all fun and games as Gabby and Rachel went on their first dates and they weren't without drama. Ladies and gentlemen, all of this nonsense means it's once again time for 63% of America loves Ted. Joining us from Bachelor headquarters, is today's official show announcer, Ted. <laughs> hey, that's me. Hey, that's me. Um, Ted, now I wasn't here last week when this crap pr premiered, so can I ask you a question not on my card? Sure. Okay, how is it so far with two bachelorettes compared to just one? So far, they're playing it nice. You know, they're, they're acting as if, you know, they're friends. They're kind of bouncing ideas off each other. I think it's a, it, it actually helps in weeding out the guys who are there for the wrong reasons. Which is all of them. Right, yeah. so, so they're able to kind of bounce off each other and work that way. But I'm not sure how long that's gonna last. And also, Ted, what does half nudity have to do with talent? Why were they all half naked? So they used, so they used to do, you know, they would do uh, a group date where they'd you know, go sumo wrestling or oil each other up and get naked. Now it's just like, hey guys, Let's just get them naked before the date. Oh, that's yeah. That's it's like no one shame. of our staff meetings, right there, Ted. It's like <laughs> our Wednesday meetings. Yes. Um, okay, let's get to the questions on hand. Rachel went on her first date with Jordan V. Tell me about that. I I believe it's our first ever Jordan with an initial for the last name. I, we've never had more than one Jordans. On never. The show. Uh, so we got Jordan V. They went on a zero gravity date. So. I mean, this seems cool. And then look at the coordination. Look at the coordination. They're making out while they are weightless. <laughs> again, again, Ted, it's like one of our staff meetings. Look at that. <laughs> and I mean, I was, I mean, this is impressive. This that, is impressive. Yeah. <laughs> now, what, what breaks my heart, she dumped him after they landed. What? I. I thought, I mean, as you saw there, they had chemistry. Did she kick him out right then? Did she kick him right out of the they, spacecraft? Uh, she, they waited until they landed. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, so we have Rachel now. The other one's name is Gabby, Ted, right? Gabby? So we got Gabby. Gabby goes on her date with... Uh, Nate. I, be I believe it's Nate. Yeah, Nate. And, uh, you know, they do the helicopter date thing, and then they go to the hot tub, of course, where they proceed to make out basically all day. Where, wait, 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 Ted, where the hell is that hot tub? Uh, you know, so, yeah, I mean, that hot tub, and you know what, Jason, I, I, I think it's important to point out here, uh, and you, your, your card uh, alludes to this, but the Jason Show research team, Thank you, Ted. Thank you for pausing for that. Yeah, they they did a lot of hard work. 
They okay. did a lot of hard work on this, and we actually found that hot tub in another, other seasons. Uh, Leo, why don't we, we roll that other hot tub video. So we've got, uh, we got Matt James there on the left, we've got Colton on the right, and they're in the exact same hot tub. Oh. Well, let's, <laughs> let's, I want to make a joke so bad, but I really don't want the tweets today. But <laughs> let's just say, let me just say this, that Colton clip hasn't aged well. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's a magic hot tub. <laughs> Maybe you come out of the hot tub a lot different than you go into the hot tub. It's a hot tub time machine. <laughs> okay, Ted, my last question on my card here. How is the dual bachelorette go? Oh, I already asked that. Well, our, our well <laughs> I previewed it. I previewed it. <laughs> I previewed it because we do have a clip where they're playing it nice for now, but just wait, because I think things between Gabby and Rachel might get a little tense. Take a look. Yeah, I like yeah. it. Yeah, and they'd think we'd have a nice connection as well. Yeah. I want to see more of it. I do too. Great. I'm really glad you're here. I feel like you've been like really sweet to me. Just really? yeah. Can I kiss you? Yeah. Logan and I have a really good conversation. He's super fun, very charming. So I think I could definitely see myself giving him a rose. What? I kiss Logan. Okay. Do you like him? I yeah. Mm -hmm. Like kind of your type. He's sweet. Yeah, I yeah. do. I like him. Yeah. That, now that makes this show interesting. Yeah. And Laura, I, we got to go, but I haven't kissed a girl since Bill Clinton was in office, but they kiss weird. Do y'all kiss like that? I mean. They do kiss weird. Okay. I. And, and last week, there was a makeout sesh that was even more weird. Uh, maybe we'll show that to you next week. Maybe we will. Ladies and gentlemen, Ted Johnson, everyone. It's me. It's me. <laughs> they kissed weird, didn't they? Yeah.